This video is on how to set up the TV Android box. Uh, after initially plugging in the HDMI cable and the power cable and powering the unit on, uh, that you're gonna be you're gonna have a screen similar to this one or another screen that may be displayed later. Uh, the first thing you want to do is you want to go in and connect to your Wi-Fi network. If you look here in the upper right corner, you'll see a Bluetooth icon and you'll see the time. In the event, most of this I'm going to have pre-done for you, but in the event that you have to do that, uh, you want to go to this sprocket looking icon, which is your settings, and then you want to go here to Wi-Fi. It'll give you a list of all the available Wi-Fi networks that it can pick up. Some may be yours, some may be your neighbors. Um, and from there, we, we just connect. Uh, you know, you put in your um, your password. And click on connect. It'll say obtaining IP address and then you'll see connected. Once it's connected, you'll see a Wi-Fi signal or a triangle antenna like icon in the upper right corner. Click the back button on the mouse and that'll take you all the way out to this main screen. At this point, the unit is functional. Um, to look at what applications are currently installed on a unit, click on this middle icon here, and that'll give you a list of the default apps that come with the unit. Um, I make customization to the unit, and we modify some things, but I just want you to see what the base unit looks like if you ever have to reinstall it from scratch. Um, it comes with um, Showbox. Uh, which allows you to watch movies. Um, it allows you streaming movies for educational purposes. It also allows you to look at, um, you get maps, Google Maps. You get popcorn, which is also another um, educational purposes only uh, mo movie um, application uh, that plays streaming video. If you have a Netflix account, you can log in with that. Um, and we have some other basic things like, um, this is one you want to become familiar with. It's called the APK Installer. If you click on that, it'll give you three icons that are used for installing, managing, and maintaining the applications on the system. Uh, but, and, but to get back to the reason why you bought the box, is one of them is going to be to go into Showbox. Um, I'm actually going to go ahead and make some customizations to the unit at this point, but this is what you basically need to know to set the box up and get it running. Um, I'm going to pause this video now, make the customization changes I need to, and then restart the video from there. Okay, thanks guys. Hang on.